Deep within the game reserves in South Africa lies a problem that started centuries ago. It's called poaching. Poaching is when hunters kill wild animals for profit. In South Africa, the rhino is a huge target for poachers because of its horns. Here are your five fast facts. Number one, poachers are paid around $75,000 per kilo for a rhino's horn. A typical rhino horn weighs about 10 kilos. Number two, poachers believe a rhino's horn can cure cancer and be used for other medicinal purposes. However, this is not true. Fingernails and rhino horns are made from the same substance. Number three, since the 1970s, the black rhino population has dropped by 90% in Africa. Now there are fewer than 2,500 left. Number four, many animals such as elephants, lions, and rhinos are now endangered due to poaching. Number five, even though there are electric fences around the perimeter of game reserves, poachers have managed to find their way into the parks. I am here with Evans, who's been working in the Karongwe Game Reserve for 14 years. He is going to tell us what the next generation of rangers are doing to prevent poaching. Thank you guys. We, as a group of guides and rangers in this property, we, our main aim is to protect animals and to save them so that the next generation can still see them. We've got a big problem when it comes to rhino poaching in our property. Since six years now, we lost four rhinos, which is too much because one rhino to get baby, it takes four years. What we're doing, we've got a 24-hour anti-poaching team that are looking after the property. Very important to look after them because otherwise, in five years, ten years to come, we won't have even one rhino in the wild. So to prevent the poachers now, what we're doing, we dehorn our rhinos in some areas. What we do, we tranquilize them and uh, cut the horns, but we cut the horns just before the nerves. By dehorning them, um, the numbers are getting lower and lower, so it's uh, um, promising that sometimes we will come back to this uh, uh, poaching, uh, rhino poaching in our area. Remember when you're visiting a place like this, you are a visitor in another animal's home. Until next time, I'm Emma Barnett and this is NextGen News.